In Tin, the principal setting is a car and urban traffic. The actors wore all their own clothes. I never interfered with the way my actors dressed or used makeup. I've never recommended a specific makeup, neither exaggerated nor downplayed it. I believe that there is a sense of unity between someone's personality and what they wear and how they make themselves up. No one knows better than them what they should wear and how they should present themselves. They're in the best place to choose that which is consistent with their inner character and feelings. I assume that when people stand in front of their wardrobes, they look into it and try to match their inner and outer signs more than they try to match the color of their blouse with that of their skirt or their shoes with their bag. Everything you see in Ten belongs to the actors and shows their own taste. Clothes, makeup, accessories, bracelets, rings, and whatever. They all belong to them and have been chosen by them. In some cases, I did interfere in some minor ways to improve the shot or to introduce a new concept. But in such a subtle way that even the actors themselves did not feel it. Well, for instance, in one sequence, the white scarf was my choice in order to give a new meaning. But I don't believe in interfering in the details of the characters. I believe in an indirect way. They are the best costume designers and the best makeup artists for themselves. But they do it unconsciously, and they should not be made aware of it. Otherwise, they would stop being themselves, and in thinking about their dress, makeup, and accessories, would create a newly forged character for themselves, which is not why they were chosen. I believe that through their appearance, even before they've uttered a word, the viewer understands something about their personality and inner world, just as they would from hearing them speak.